I told you guys, I told you guys that this was probably coming, didn't I? Hello guys, once again, it's Matt. Thank you all the members and patrons, make sure to subscribe. And the Iranian F-14A is coming to the game, guys. This is, this is interesting. This is really, really interesting. So yes, as an event vehicle, the next event will be for the Iranian F-14. Uh, this will be obviously an F-14A, a very early F-14A actually. But the cool part is that they are adding, apparently, some of the mod modifications um, done to it. So, uh, R-27s, as you see, are going to be able to be shot from the uh, F-14, which is pretty cool. Another thing that I need to talk about is that, uh, yeah, it's going to be for the US as a rank 8, uh, which makes sense. Again, I talked about this a little bit on uh, the F-14 video and the video about the... Um, you know, event vehicles that probably are coming, right? And uh, the Iranian vehicle, like the F-14, uh, would make a lot more sense in the US anyway, right? So it, it makes sense. It really does make sense. Of course, you will have the M9s, uh, the Sparrows, the M54s. And I mean, I don't know if they are confirming or not. Like, it's complicated, but I think they are confirming, right? They, they don't say it. Probably there will be a dev blog about it. Uh, in the future, probably like tomorrow or something. Um, but yeah, I will do a video about it. But they they say how they use the Fakur 90 and the Sigil. I don't know if I'm butchering that. Um, and of course the Asset as well, uh, which are active and semi-active radar guided missiles. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, the Fakur is based off of the M54. The Sigil, I don't know exactly, but uh, yeah. And uh, yeah, the ACR will be a rocket, a big rocket, apparently, like a big, really, really big rocket. So apparently you will have some different weapon systems. And of course, the skin and everything, uh, you can see it right here. Very, very cool skin uh, for the uh, after, you know, revolution skin, you know, of the F-14, which is pretty cool. Hopefully we have a before one as well. Um, and yeah, you can have some other, I mean, the event itself will be pretty much the same as we all know, right? From the August 8th until the 26th, each two days you earn points inside the game playing air battles and then you get the vehicle. That's pretty much what it is, right? You can get some decals and um, avatars. This one is probably the coolest one. Yeah, uh, there is a picture of this guy, uh, the Jal Jalil Zandi. I, I, I might be wrong, but I think this is the guy that has the most kills on an F-14, if I'm not mistaken. It's an ace, and the guy, like, the guy was good. So, um, yeah, pretty cool. Uh, of course, the trophy, you can get some of the stuff as well, premium count, silver lines, and everything. Uh, because, of course, each stage, each two days, you get something, right? Um, stage one, you get a random reward with the trophy, right? Stay two, one of the prize decals, one of these uh, that I talked about. And then a uh, silver chest uh, travel suitcase. Uh, this is a chest, of course, so that you can get something. One of the prize decals again, a trophy, uh, icon for the Jalil Zandil, Zandi. Silver chest again, the non tradable coupon of the F14, and a unique camouflage uh, and four random modifications, which I found it's very, very cool. You not only get your vehicle, um, but you get form random modifications that help you get it um, spaded, uh, as well as a unique accomplish. So, very, very cool. Of course, you can have the discount, as always, if you get very close to the amount of points that you can get. Uh, you can buy it by some, like, less Golden Eagles than the 999. And, of course, the coupon uh, for selling is the normal 750,000. I still think it's too much, but, yeah. If you want to get it, you need 750,000 mission points throughout the whole event to actually sell this vehicle. This will probably be a very expensive vehicle, to be honest, right? But honestly, man, why would you sell this thing? Like, come on, it's the coolest F-14 ever. It's an F-14 that will take Russian weaponry on it. It's the weirdest F-14 ever. So, very, very cool. I'm excited about this event. Thank you, Gaijin. This is the event type of event that I want personally. So this is pretty amazing, pretty good. And yeah, I told you guys an F-14A for Iran would eventually come. So yeah, I see you guys on the next one. Make sure to subscribe and bye guys. See you.